You know what people really want is to be profitable, make $1,000 a week, you know, be a successful day trader, buy all the houses, cars, Lamborghinis, women, all that. You know what people don't want to do? The work. And you want to know the worst part of the work? The back testing and the demo testing. In this video, I'm going to tell you exactly why it's the most crucial step in your day trading journey. Okay, I'm going to break it down into the most simplest way possible. Back testing should be quick. It should just verify the validity of your strategy. If you can glance backwards and see that you had decent success with it, you should move forward into demo testing. You don't have to spend hundreds of hours on back testing and getting everything absolutely perfect. It is difficult to remove the bias from back testing. And whatever your back testing results are, however many trades you win, reduce that number by 20%. So of all of the winners that you marked down as winners, only 80% of those were actually winners. I'm going to show you why in a second. To do that, let's jump onto the charts. So as I was formulating a strategy for my bot, because I needed to do a simple trading strategy in a simple language because I don't know anything about coding. So I figured one trade a day at market open, let's go. And so what I did every single day at New York Open, I would enter in a long or a short position. That long or short position was 100% based on which direction that first candle was. Now let's look at this trade in particular right here, because you can see it hit the stop loss and then it went to take profit. What most of you guys do during your back testing is you would zoom in to a lower time frame and figure, oh, if I would have just done that, it would have been a winner. So I'm going to do this and I'm going to have my same stop loss. Oh, see, it didn't stop me out and it hit my take profit. No, you made the mistake. It's a loss. This this is that 20% that I'm talking about. Some of them are so close where, you know, the wick would have touched your stop. No, the spread would have stopped you out. You were a loser that day. So when you're back testing, start with a strategy that only goes into one trade per day. Whatever that strategy is, I don't care if it's from the trading floor using one of our indicators or it's something you learned on YouTube. Whatever strategy has been working for you, you should go back test it. If it's more than one trade a day, probably not that great. If it's 15 trades per day, it's horrible. If it's five, okay. Okay, you're scalping on the three minute or the five minute, I'll let you have it. But you should go back at least the entire previous year. So start from January and go to January because right now it's January. Do that, see if it's viable, and then move forward into demo testing. Demo testing, also known as forward testing, is doing your trade setup in the live markets risk-free on a demo account. A demo account is a simulation of live trading with zero risk. The same way that pilots learn how to fly in a simulator not a Boeing 747. So you have to simulate your trading experience with zero risk, which is why you have a demonstration account. They are free on every single broker. Sign up for one of those. And if you want to do a personal account, make that demo account $1,000 or $10,000, whatever amount of money you're going to put into your personal account. If you want to go the route of funded traders, start with a $100,000 demo account. But here is the key rule. You have to sign up for that account and never start over. All Always stick with the same demo account to see all of your fuck ups right in your face. So many of you, and I know you've done this, have done a demo account, had a ton of losing trades and said, I'm going to start over. And you kind of brush all of those negative losses and all the bad habits under the rug and you start fresh and you're like, see, I'm a winner. No, you're not. You ignored the losses and you didn't learn from those mistakes. Open up a demo, never change it. Only trade the same demo account forever. Now, if you blow it, obviously, Obviously you have to start over, but print out all those trades and paste it onto your wall in front of your trading setup just so that you can clearly see you done fucked up. Every day when you get on the charts, you're going to look for your trade setup. You're going to get into your trade. If you don't see your trade setup, you're not going to trade that day. You are going to do the same thing day in and day out until you have a demo account that you can consistently be five, six, eight. 12% in profit every single month. So your time horizon needs to get bigger. I know you want money now, but it's not going to happen that way. You need to do the work first before you can buy the Lamborghinis. And the work takes months. Back testing, you could do it in a day. If you really went at it and you marked up all your trade setups, you could do it in an eight hour period for the entire year. Sign up for a demo account and start doing that thing. And I want you month over month. I want at least three months of consistent profit before you open up a real account with live money in it, whether it's $1,000 or $10,000, or before you even start a funded account challenge. Don't waste your money on that. That's $500. If you're not ready to pass, don't sign up for it. You're literally throwing your money away. 
Now, while demo trading, if you want to go the route of funded trader, you're going to start with that $100,000, right? At the same time, what I want you to do is start doing challenge account free trials. It's exactly like a demo account. It's zero risk. They are free to use. If you can pass free trials consistently as you're demoing, put on the same exact trades on both accounts, then you will have more confidence when you come into a real challenge account, risking your real money to pass that thing. And the best part, if you use the link down below for Funder Pro, if you're in profit on a free trial, before your free trial is over, if you're in profit, you can take that profit and transition it into a live challenge account. So you'll have a head start and already be in profit on that challenge account. But I'm telling you, the back testing should be quick and rough and whatever numbers you get, 80% of that is correct. The real work comes in demo trading. You have to do it for months and months and months. And I know it sucks and you're not going to be making any money, but it's what you need to do in order to do this long term and be consistent. Because if you get lucky one day and you win the lottery and you had a huge trade because you over leveraged and you didn't do your analysis right, it was just like, ah, I guess I'll buy right here. And you made a ton of money. You cannot replicate that. So it's not consistent long term. Stop being a loser and do a demo account.